Meet Maria Zakharova, director of Russia's press department of the Ministry of Foreign Affairs. During her most recent press briefing, Zakharova absurdly blames Ukraine and the West for the attack on the Kakovka Dam. Zakharova conveniently overlooks the fact that such an act is in no way beneficial to Ukraine. Zakharova argues that the water level in the Kokovka Reservoir was intentionally raised by Ukraine. However, earlier, Ukraine reported Russia had in fact raised the water level before destroying the dam. This was done on purpose, with the aim to prevent the armed forces of Ukraine from launching a counter-offensive in the area. Zakharova blames the armed forces of Ukraine for conducting a test strike using US weapons on the dam. This was done to assess the impact it has on the water level of the Kokovka Reservoir. She used manipulative narratives about wasting American taxes and the low level of education in the USA. Zakharova calls for the international community to punish Ukraine and its allies. She claims that Ukraine, funded by the US, has become an anti-humanitarian regime. However, Ukrainians are actively involved in evacuating citizens from the devastating floods, while the Russian army showed little to no sign of evacuation efforts as they themselves retreated. Zakharova misleads how Ukraine has no choice but to fight to the death because it needs to pay its dues for the weapons provided by the West. Furthermore, Zakharova falsifies information about the condition of Ukraine's military personnel. She uses statements that lack credibility as they disregard the available evidence. This press briefing depicts the typical manipulative rhetoric of Maria Zakharova.